Lesson 2.2 Inverse Variation Inverse variation in two quantities x and y If x increases, then y decreases When x decreases, y increases So magkabaliktad naman ito Kapag si x ay tumaas, si y bababa At kapag naman si x ay bumaba, si y ay tataas Inverse variation If the product of x and y is constant k Then y is said to vary inversely as x Or y is inversely proportional to x In equation, it is written as Y is equal to k over x Where k is called the constant of variation Or the constant of proportionality So in inverse Variation, the phrase that you are going to look for is the word inversely and inversely proportional. So these are the phrases that describes the variation that is inverse. Inverse variation examples. Number one, the number of pizza slices P varies inversely as the number of person N sharing the whole pizza. Now, again, what phrase describes the variation? So, it says here, varies inversely. So, meaning, our variation is inverse variation. And, the, our variable is the number of pizza slice P and the person or the number of person sharing the pizza, which is N. So, The equation that describes this problem is P varies inversely, so that is K over N. So, P, number of pizza slices, varies inversely as the person shares. Number two, the number of petchai plants N in a row varies inversely as the spaces S between them. So again, our phrase is varies inversely. So our variable is a variable N, number of petchai plants, and the spaces between them, which is S. So the equation that illustrates this problem will be N is inversely proportional to S. So, therefore, the equation is N is equal to K over S. Number 3. The length L of a rectangular field is inversely proportional to its width W. So, again, our phrase that describes the variation is inversely proportional. Our Our variable is L and for length and W for width. So the equation that illustrates this problem will be length is inversely proportional to its width. So L is equal to K over W. Number four, the base B of a triangle is inversely proportional to its altitude h. So again, the phrase is inversely proportional. Our variable is base b and the altitude h. So the equation this, that illustrates this problem or expresses the variation is b is inversely proportional to its width. So, or to its altitude. So b is equal to k over h direction tell whether if the following expresses inverse variation so number one we have table of values x and y so for our values of x we have 3 6 9 and 12 and for the values of y we have 2 1 2 thirds and 1 half so we are going to get the points so we have 3 2 the points 3 2 We also have the point 6, 1. And we also have the point 9, 
and two thirds, and also we have the points twelve, one half. Okay, so from our inverse variation, so we have y x is inversely proportional to y. So our x is three. So we have three is equal to k over two. Then cross multiply. So our k is equal to six. Because 2 times 3 is 6. Then, for this one, x is inversely proportional to y. So, we have 6 is equal to k over 1. So, k divided by the 1. So, k is equal to 6. Then, for this one, x is equal to k over y. So, we have 9 is equal to 2. Sorry, k over 2 thirds. So, this is 1. So, that will become k is equal to 9 times 2 thirds. For cross multiply. So, k is equal to 2 times 9 is 18 over 3. So, k is equal to 6. Then, for this one, 12 is equal, sorry, k, x is equal to k over y, so we have 12 is equal to k over 1 half, so we have cross multiply, so we have k is equal to 12 times 1 half, so k is equal to 12 over 2, so, K is equal to 6. So, therefore, this illustrates an inverse variation. Inverse variation siya kasi ang value ng K ay pare-pareho. Kung titignan ninyo ang value ng X, so we have 3, 6, 9, 12, X increases. And for the value of y, so we have 2, 1, 1 third, 1 half. So this is 2, 1, 0.66, and 0.5. So y is decreasing, x is increasing. So there is an inverse variation. Number 2. So we have the graph here. So we have the length L and the width W. Okay, so we have three points, distinct point. So we have three, four. We have four, three. And we have six, two. So our, our equation is L varies inversely as W. L varies inversely as W. L varies inversely as W. So, our L is 4. Equals K over 3. So, 4 times 3. Cross multiply. So, K is equal to 12. Then, for this one. So, bakit naging ganon? Kasi ang 3, siya ang value niya ay W at ang 4 ang L. So, una dito ang W at saka L. W at saka L. Okay, so ang ating L for number 2 is 3, which is equal to K over W, which is 4. So, cross multiply, so K is equal to 12. And also, with this one, so, we have 2 is equal to k over 6. Cross multiply. So, we have k is equal to 12. So, therefore, all the values of our k is 12. So, our constant is 12. So, therefore, the graph illustrates inverse variation.
Illustrative examples number one. Find the value of k. For letter A, y varies inversely as x and y is equal to 12 when x is equal to 5. So our solution will be, so we are going to substitute, okay, so our equation will be y is equal to k over x. So y, so find k when y is 12 equals k over 5. Then cross multiply, so we have k is equal to 12 times 5, so k is equal to 60. Then for number 2, so we have y bars inversely as x, so y is equal to k over x, so y is 18, when x is 2. So over 1. So we have k is equal to 18 times 2. Cross multiply. So k is equal to 16 carry 1 36. So k is equal to 36. Example number 2. If w varies inverse less y and w is equal to 2, when y is equal to 3, find w when y is equal to 6. So again, dun muna tayo sa first phrase. So y varies inversely as, or w varies inversely as y. So this is will be our equation. So our equation will be, so we have w is equal to, k over y. So, w is inversely, varies inversely as y. Then, w is equal to 2 equals k over 3. So, cross multiply. So, k is equal to 2 times 3. So, k is equal to 6. So, from here, our equation will be w is equal to 6 over y. So find y or find w when y is 6. So w is equal to 6 over y is 6. So w is equal to 1. Number 3. If p varies inversely as the square of q and p is equal to 3 when q is 4, find p when q is 16. So again, our first phrase will give us the equation. Okay. So our equation will be P varies inversely as the square of Q. Then, for our second phrase, and P is 3 when Q is 4. We are looking to find for the value of K. So, we'll have P is 3 when Q is 4. So, K over 4 squared. So, 3 is equal to K over 4 times 4 is 16. So, we have cross multiply. So, K is equal to 3 times 6 is 18, carry 1, 48. So, k is equal to 48. Now, our equation will be p is equal to 48 over q squared. Now, find p when q is 16. So, 48 over 16 squared. p is equal to 48 over 16 times 16 is 256. Then simplifying this, so P is equal to divide both sides by 16 as the greatest common to them. So we have 48 divided by 16 is 3 over 256 divided by 16 that is 16. 
So therefore, our P is equal to 3 over 16. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe my YouTube channel. Sir, Axila.